calculating on a primary. The calculating is hard because I'm trying to make something fit around this general size. You know what I mean? Using the same MMC without spending more money. But you can see I've wrapped it in some uh, little screen there. Grounded it. Not all the way around though because I still need to access my some stuff in there. But uh, as long as I keep the breakout point to the side it should be fine. I feel like I can more reliably run it now. So now I'm basically going to still feed in 340 uh, VDC. But I've just got it set up to where I can read the uh, AC amps. And it does get pretty high but... Um, as long as I don't push the on time too high, I still don't exceed this 500 watt variate. So it's not bad. I'm going to show the variations in the output depending on how how far, how far much closer in tune I bring the two coils. Alright, so this is going to be... About 150 microsecond on time. Also... Take note of the voltage rise. closer to right on dual resonance you see I get these little dips and peaks now in the voltage same on time crank the on time higher in this setup but uh you can see I get that the change in the output Keeps turning my damn shit on. It actually hurts my damn ears just running it that long.
175 second on time, 175 microsecond on time. I can further crank it up to closer to 175 and it wants to actually strike the ground and a little further out more but when it does that it sort of it jumps up to about 5 amps so all the way up 150 off this you know still only pulling you know like 5 amp this little variac so that's pretty cool to me